this delicious I swear. Be prepared. Hey, welcome back, Mango Three. I'm here. We're gonna try a new game. This is called Honkai Star Rail. Um, we're gonna see, try something different. See what's new. Uh, kind of finished up the other one, so I'll try this. See how it works. No idea how good it is or how it turned out. I also don't know the button, so we'll find out. First time opening. This is a space travel or space free. System time. Very punctual, Kafka. Elio always tells the exact future. So what's with the explosion just now? Was that also part of his script? Uh-huh. 2344-59 system time. The pulses from the explosion cause a massive breakdown from the master control. <laughs> no. The antimatter legion did it. They completely invaded the space station two system hours ago. Alright, so do we need to fight the Legion? I don't know. I don't know if you anything about it, so it doesn't matter. Got it. So from now on, I'll be in charge of this operation. Copy. Can you let me have some fun this time? Our last few operations turned out to be pretty dull. Sorry, I'm afraid there is not much I can do for you. Our task this time is just to place the target, but if you want to go for some fun yourself, I won't stop you. I mean, after all. After all, Elio didn't put it in the script. Why would it matter? Oh, that's cool. Who's this? Herta? Yeah. 
She looks so young. She was already famous in the last Amber era, no? She has to be at least a hundred years old. She's a member of the Genius Society, and an emanator of New Sierra Edition. She can probably age backwards if she wanted. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, I seem to recall that over half of the Genius Society's 80-odd members had a normal death. Wasn't there someone who lived for a dozen days or so? What was their name? <laughs> That's pretty normal. Aren't the mortal bosses in games always waiting for the protagonist to come kill them? <laughs> Immortality is not always a good thing. <laughs> oh, what an alliance joke. Matter Legion become so weak. I could only attract this much. Did you really want the entire Legion to come here? This lot won't be able to slow down the Astral Express crew. Relax. A Jose Beast is also here. I know this person. She's the Lord of Silence. Poka Kakamon. You see? Her face is all blank. She had destroyed all of her own portraits and sculptures in the entire universe. I'm not interested. Hurry up with our real business. This is Xander. Xander won Kuwabara, the first genius in history. The one who supposedly created news? Yeah, that's him. If the legends are true, then he was a man who created an Eon. Well, they better be false. I don't want to be a Xandar creature. Who's this old guy with a white beard? No idea. A society member? Who's this? Uh, no idea. <laughs> hey, Silver Wolf, look. It's Screwlem, your good old opponent. Ha! Huh? I told you already. I didn't. Oh, that battle was how Alio got his eyes on you. Imagine someone actually able to crack Screwlem's code. First Screwlem, then Herta. Uh, there's probably no one else in the universe who offended two genii in such quick succession. It must be destiny. Ugh. Seems like I'm the real destiny slave here. That breathing sensation, remember it. Of course not. 
I'm just amazed that this fancy technique of yours is usual. <sighs> just a little trick of tampering with the data of reality. I wouldn't call it fancy. What were you looking at so intently just now? Let me see. Hertz Toys, a catalog featuring the space station's collection of rare items. They've got a lot of interesting gadgets. Like what? There's this gun. It can rate any creature within its crosshair as a score from 0 to 100. Uh, doesn't sound very interesting. Aren't you curious about how much you would score? I kind of want to know mine. Fine. I guess we can swing by and play with it. It's not too far. What's our destination? Go down the corridor behind the door on the left. There's a room where some kind of... So that's where the stellar on is. Cancer of all worlds. That's where we can find out where the Stellaron is. Alright, we have a new character. Silver Wolf. Nobody minds me destroying these buckets here. Hey, our first treasure. is up ahead. There will be lots of Legion Void Rangers there. Okay. May as well kill them all. Ready Player One. Unlock all tutorials. <laughs> There's like a repeat of everything they showed before. for reading that. Hold it. Someone or something is up ahead. Looks like we're the ones getting ambushed. But they're the ones getting besieged. <laughs> you took the bait just like that. That gives you a skill point and you can use skills to do super powerful stuff. Good times never last. Time to say bye. Boom. 
This will take a while. Not a single soul here. Impressive evacuation work. Did Herda organize it herself? According to the access history, she hasn't logged in here for over six months. The evacuation was directed by the acting lead researcher, a girl named Asta. It doesn't ring a bell. Oh, right. Elio said we wouldn't run into Herta. It seems she really isn't here. Where's the Stellaron? Elio's script doesn't include any info about the location of the Stellaron, which means in the future he foresees... We would find the Stellaron in a non-physical way. This space station is packed with extraordinary objects. I wouldn't be surprised if there's one that can make it happen. Well, hiding something extraordinary with something extraordinary. This is pretty Herta. I assume you know what to do. I mean, you've read the catalog for quite a while. I've got all the clues we need. The only piece missing is a simple trick. Help me investigate the terminal in this room. Our item might be inside. Okay, the stage is yours. <sighs> and I can see the whole space station on the surveillance screen. <laughs> Not the Stellaron. Even if you could, it'd be a trap. Herta doesn't display her collections. Huh? I can't see the memory storage for this terminal. This is the monitoring room. They must have deleted the records and made a run for it. Classic. <sighs> Make your way over here then. There's no point in trying to search like this. So, got a master plan? I'm all ears. It's a matter of hacking the surveillance system directly. Ah, uh, I see. Hertus collections aren't in the system, so anything unaffected should be our target. That's the computer. Simple, crude, but effective. Look, found it. That's what I was talking to in the beginning. Hmm, what's this? Item number 211, line spot. A simple light deflecting field. It allows an object in its field to pass unnoticed, but if a different item ceases to be obvious, the object gets revealed. So, Herta hides her collection with something as simple as this? The simplest method is the hardest to spot. Isn't that our motto? Strange thing number two. The data suggests it's just an ordinary hologram, but it has an added layer. Let's take a look. Don't worry, this place won't be our grave. Interesting. She's a member of the Genius Society, all right. Stellaron is up ahead. Let's hurry. It has its own security system. I guess even for Herda, Stellaron is no ordinary rarity. Can you get it? Of course. Even the genius Herda can't compete with me when it comes to hacking. Good. Then I'll also count on you with the preparation of the receptacle. The receptacle's ready. Your decision. <laughs> <laughs> Elio said this decision will bring about lots of changes. He also said, it must be you who makes it. This is what happened in Genshin. You have the two people floating and you choose her or him. Well, 
want to give him a new name. <laughs> there we go. How much does he remember? Hm, I'll remember you. Time to get up. She put something into my chest. I think that was the stellar run. Where am I? Who are you? I thought you'd remember me. Maybe you're not as important as you think. Listen, you are in a daze right now. You don't know who you are, why you're here, or what you're going to do next. You think I look familiar, but you're not sure if you should trust me. None of that matters. All you need to know is that I'm leaving, and you will be left all alone on this space station. From now on, you needn't think about your past or doubt yourself. Listen. In the near future, you will encounter all kinds of perils and hardships, but you will also have many wonderful experiences. You'll meet companions who will treat you like family and embark on surreal adventures with them. At the end of your journey, all that perplexes you and troubles you will resolve. This is your future that Elio has foreseen. Do you like it? I guess. No, I don't want it. Where are you going? Oh, they know I don't want it. This is also a lovely answer. So, Elio can foresee the future, but he can't make decisions for you. Use that will of yours to reach the end of your story. That's the you I like. How long do you think you need? According to the script, the Astral Express crew is arriving soon. We should avoid being seen by them. I know, Silver Wolf. Just give me another minute. I must leave now. Don't worry, someone will come and find you very soon. Just go with them. You won't remember a thing except me. When you have no. a chance to make a choice, make one that you know you won't regret. Aren't the coordinates sent out from the space station? Who cares? They're here and alive. Do they look like a mannequin to you? <sighs> Weak heartbeat and pulse. March, you better do CPR. Uh-huh. Uh, I've never done it before. Don Hung, you do it. <sighs> Wait, stop it. They're awake. <sighs> Are you all right? Can you hear me? Do you remember your name? Mangler 3M. I don't remember a thing. Aw, oh, this isn't good. Can you try harder? I'm sure you can at least remember your name. There we go. Nice to meet you. My name's Don Hung. And this is March 7th. This space station was just attacked by the Antimatter Legion. We came to help with the rescue at the request of lead researcher Astor. The Antimatter Legion? Goon zoned by the destruction. You're lucky the most dangerous Lord Ravager among them isn't around. Just some nasty minions. We'll take those invaders out soon. Don't worry. Lead researcher uh, Astor? Huh? A petite cutie with pink hair? Madame Herda appointed her to be the acting lead researcher. Pink hair, March 7th. That girl really needs What's... to step up. I can't believe her own employee doesn't even know her name. Where should I go? Back to the master control zone. Asta and the other researchers have gathered there. Plus, that's where we parked the Astral Express. Don't you worry. We'll protect you from the monsters and clear up this mess. 
Who are you guys? Dahong and I are members of the Astral Express crew. Well, the Express has some dealings with Madame Herta. So we come to visit the space station from time to time. We just so happen to arrive during this invasion. Of course, as a <clears throat> crew of heroes, we're happy to lend a hand. The Astral yeah. Express? You've never seen it? The Express comes here every once in a while. It's a unique train that can travel between the stars with the power of the Trailblaze Eon. I'll show you once we're back to the Master Control Zone. Let's go then. march go back together. Our land from the security department lost contact in the vicinity. I need to find him first. Oh, all right. You stay safe. Hmm. Maybe you should take this. The Legion are rampaging through the space station like a pack of wolves. This trip won't be a walk in the park. It's better if you have something to protect yourself. Is that a baseball bat? Just a suggestion, though. You're safe as long as you stick with me. Weird shape thing. Characters. Alright, open the characters, see? Detailed information, type of character, destruction. Check out the other one. Use a preservation. Alright. What's this? Nothing. Light cone. Oh. Ah, it's supposed to be like stars. Use ice. I'm fighting. Space anchor. That's a healing thing. It's like a statue. Curio contained in it. Or not yet, though. Joy filtration. Curio 269, Joy Filtration Set, Portable Device Inside the Cube, used to identify and collect joyous emotions. Carefully count the cubes, store the portable devices, there are 21 in total, you can count a few more times, but end up with a di different figure each time. Okay, let's count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, more than 21. After effects have not been removed, not all curious spaces you can display here. Crack up conch. Conch. 148. Conch. Crack up conch. This conch makes strange sound, unlike laughter. Not it is unlike laughter, but nevertheless quite humorous. This place is full of fancy little gadgets. Herta's collection. I really don't get why she'd go out of her way to collect them and then leave them here to gather dust. Rating pistol. Number 752 rating pistol weapon rates creatures on sight using unknown scoring logic. Closed eye, the weir gun snaps at the swirls around a moment. Staring at you with malice. Glazed at me, 84 points. Alright. Is this gun pulling your leg? I'm at 84 already, I just started. Total Eclipse of the Heart. Warning notice affixed next to it reads Do not activate the stop permission for the station. Okay. Collected a log. Okay. Uh, it's the antimatter legion. So these crazy. It is a baseball bat. Look at that. I thought it looked like a baseball bat, and it really is. Weakness type. Okay.
Ice was the weakness. Ah, it makes him bleed. I see. R.I.P. Home Run. My hit is an R.I.P. Home Run. That's awesome. You're stronger than you look. You seem to be quite the fighter. Weakness. Oh, okay. to go down to the master control zone. Do you know the way? Um, I noticed that you're not wearing the space station staff uniform. Do you really work here? Mm, da, da, da. Never mind. I won't ask if you don't want to talk about it. Let's go. I'll take you to the safe zone. All right, treasure. Can I level up? Can't break that. Uh, another monster. Weakness type. Ooh, he's got a weakness against me. me defense chooses me defense Stay right there while I give you a present but now they're gonna hit me but I have a let's go Just like a statue. Encyclopedia. He knows a ton of complicated stuff. 
Maybe the elevator is here. Uh, I don't know that one. Whoa! <sighs> Why are you here? How did you get here before us? I took another route to the upper level, and I saw you guys from up there. Arlan is in the control room. He's been injured, but not fatally. You found him. Will he know what to do about this elevator? I suppose as the head of the security department, he should know. Then let's go talk to him. New character, Don Hung. Team setup, change lineup. thing opened up that we thought it might. Freeze. Oh, nice. Long distance during the battle. <laughs> wah, wah. send you to help? Uh, it's just a coincidence. We came to deliver the rare relic Herta trusted us to find. We didn't expect to arrive during an invasion. Why is the Antimatter Legion targeting you guys? It seems they just ignored the surface of the planet and came straight to the space station. I have no idea. The Legion came at a very suspicious time, almost right after the security system suddenly failed. Lady... Lead researcher Asta immediately began to organize the evacuation. I was supposed to cover everyone as they evacuated, but I didn't expect to end up failing in this task. Don't be too hard on yourself. Your leg and dominant hand were injured. It was a wise decision to hide here and avoid a head-on encounter with the Legion. Yeah, most of the staff have been evacuated safely. So right now our highest priority is to return to the Master Control Zone and plan a counterattack. So, do you know how to use the elevator? I couldn't start it. After the evacuation was complete, the elevators were all shut down to keep the Legion away from the Master Control Zone. Since Lady Asta sent you to look for me, I assume she must have given you the encryption key for accessing the elevator system? Oh, right. She did give me some sort of card. Hmm. March. But where did I put it? You... Oh, here it is! Uh. <sighs> now that we found the key, we should get going. 
can use that console over there to unlock the elevator. Let's go. Hold on. I only activated the elevator on the highest floor. We have to go there to use it. Okay. Sorry. The space station was entrusted to Lady Austin by Madame Herda. I must do this for the safety of the master control zone and the staff there. So I'll we'll have to trouble you to take a bit of the detail. Sincerest apologies. Uh huh? You're not coming with us? My leg is injured. I'd only slow you down. I'll stay here and shut down the elevator once you've made it to the master control zone. You won't slow us down. And you should be able to shut down the elevators from the master controls. Agreed. He and I made it here safely. And now we've also got Dong Hung. We're more than enough to protect you. Let us worry about the Antimatter Legion. You just follow us and keep yourself alive. Don't overthink this. Thank you. Traces. Level up traces to enhance the character. Ice damage up 3%. Nice. Okay, so it's a web of uh, skills. Four percent, nice. Three point two percent. Just might as well, you know. Do you know why the antimatter region would invade the station, Arlan? They must have come for Madame Herta's collection. But as to why, I still. Never heard of it. You have the worst luck running into me. It's like you break their defense and then they might take a turn off or not. How was she carrying that? It just appeared. You couldn't have done it without me. Bridge has been shut down? Yes, to stop the enemy, more or less. Back on.
have no interest in soaking cotton. <laughs> I told you I could fight. Let's use this one first. The truth of life and death revealed in an instant. Oh, only a single target. Yes, we're taking the other one. sanctuary is but a vision. My turn. Oh, we don't need to worry about this difference anymore. Was attacking his dead. Watch this. Like a baseball. <laughs> Home run. Hmm, they run slower uphill, that's interesting. Ooh, look what I found. It's in your profile. No. Light cones are guardian of recollection technology. They allow you to carry memories around. Very potent enhancement items. I heard the corporation paid a lot for the usage rights. But I've no idea how Herta managed to get hold of one. They were acquired legitimately. That's all I can say. Take them. They're very useful in combat. Destruction, okay, so whoever has destruction can use that one. That's me. Increases... Slightly increases everything. Increases everything, okay. Make it quick. What about this? 
Yeah, we broke the shield. Everybody's got their ultimates. Rules are made to be broken. I can use my ultimate even though I don't have any actions. Try that again. Gotta try hard sometimes. Check out this awesome move. Yeah, frozen. Watch this. Step aside. I have no injury. Didn't even need that ultimate. In your face, Mr. Connecticut Templar. More than one. That was a drone or something. Why does it always have to get this exciting? Anyway, at least you're back. but I couldn't just blow up the space station with it. Herta would not like that. <sighs> Are you alright, Arlam? Asta's they're worried about you. I'm fine. A quick patching up will do. Thanks for asking. I'll report the situation to lead researcher Asta immediately. Bye. Hey, nice to meet you. I'm Himiko, navigator of the Astral Express. In other words, she's in charge of where the express goes. March hasn't been any trouble for you along the way, has she? Think carefully about how you want to reply to that. Never met a more reckless girl in my life. Never met a more lively girl in my life. In that case, I'd rather not answer. Huh. Looks like we have two Don Hums on our team now. <sighs> Please leave me out of this. <laughs> Look at you all. You've already gotten really close. Come on, Aston's been worried about all of you. Alright, we got a new character. Himeko. She has red hair. They want me to go there, so let's go everywhere. I don't want to die. Okay, look, I knew there's going to be stuff to read. Quick read. Like a chest, but it's just a briefcase. Maybe I'll find light. Light colors. Desertion proposal? 
People don't mind me just randomly picking up stuff, right? Alright, I guess we found everything. I think we've traveled everywhere. Projectile radar tracking normal. Telemetry signal frequency unusually high. Maintain at normal levels. Our measurements predict that the Legion is about to unleash over 10 waves of continuous attacks. Everyone, brace yourselves. Asta, we're back. Oh, I'm glad you're all back safe. Arlen just told me about the situation at the storage zone and about his injury. Thank you for all your help. In times of disaster, I realize more and more that the space station's researchers are its most valuable assets. Alas, we were ill-prepared for such emergencies. We should have built up our security and combat departments. But on the other hand, the entire crew of the Astral Express seems to be extraordinarily skilled. What is the crew situation on the space station? The situation is under control for now. The damage to our security system is minor. The intruder only managed to alter a small amount of data, so it was easy to fix. The real problem lies with the researchers. They trust Madame Herta wholeheartedly and never thought that the space station would be breached by the Legion. Hmm. A broken spirit is far worse than a broken body. Let's go speak with the researchers. Right now, the space station can't afford any more unexpected turns, especially from within. Have you tried contacting Herta? Meet Pumpkin. He's watching. He smells funny. Did he get sprayed? <laughs> multiple letters, all met with silence. You know her, Himiko? The space station is but a mere warehouse for followers and ham. rare items. He just she finds her. Really care about it. Some of the videos are on YouTube, you can watch them. I knew it. No matter. I'll also send a letter to Herda and tell her that we've brought the rare item she seeks. At least that might get her attention. Oh, that would be of great help. Warp. Warp to obtain new characters and light cones. To obtain characters and light cones from warps. Make a warp. This is the uh, time thing, the money thing. Alright, we got Amber. I mean, Asta. And she's fired. Harmony. Cool. Purchase one. 
I don't have enough. I only have 119. Every 10 guarantees a 4 star. Ooh. Try to get her. We just had her in the intro. Incessant Rain, a new character. So that's interesting. So they want... These are... I didn't know they were 5 star. See, 5 star... Rain... Huh. And there's also this one. Departure. 20% off. Your starter work. You get... For every 10 you use, you actually only have to spend 8. Thanks. Ask if our line needs help. I'll leave the reassurance of the researchers in your hands. If you have any other questions, you're welcome to come to Himiko and me. If only I caught the Antimatter Legion sooner. How are you feeling? Oh, I'm fine. This pain is nothing, really. I'm used to it. In fact, I should be proud of it. It's a reminder of being able to protect everyone. <clears throat> but, uh, don't tell lead researcher Asta what I just said. How's the space station? There were a few researchers who didn't make it. The rest are fine. Mostly minor injuries. But I'm worried about their mental states. Most of them came to the space station because they admired Madame Herta. But now they can't reach her or even their own families. I just hope they can all survive this crisis. Well, it's as to like. My first impression was that she was the daughter of a rich family. Owners of a big company. She was kind to me, though. When she went to the space station, I followed her. I don't know much about science, but I'm glad to be able to protect people in pursuit of their research. All right, I'll let you get some rest. I hope all this chaos will end soon. Hmm. What are these? Are these? Oh, more light cones. Three of them. Ah, everyone gets a light cone. Yep, they give one for each character. Even my brand new character. So I randomly got that character I just met. I wonder if that's not really random. Push the stick down, Alfred. Oh, sorry. Sorry, I got the wrong person. Let me help. Thanks, kid. We're doing some pre-checks for the satellite remote sensing. I'll hold down the button to monitor the signal. And you push the control stick according to my instructions. All right. First, let's talk about the controls. Up is the spectrometer, down is the filter, left is the reference level, and right is the attenuator. Our pre-checks have three steps. Turning on the spectrometer, then the attenuator, and finally outputting the signal to the filter. Up, right, it's down. quite a bit to remember. You got everything? Sure. Are you ready? Three, two... One. Up, right, down. Wonderful, thank you. <laughs> that was very helpful of you, kid. Alfred was the researcher in charge of this. He was in the storage zone earlier. He didn't make it back. Abraham was close to him. <sighs> I don't know how to tell him about it. But top priority is to preserve the space station and concentrate on the work at hand. I 
need to leave. I need to run from this forsaken... No, it's impossible. I can run from yesterday. I can run from today, but tomorrow will always be one step ahead of me. Look! The obstacle detection terminal has recorded 142,856 attacks. The next count will be 142,857! I know in my heart that when I see that hopelessly beautiful cyclic number, it will mean the poetic end of my life cycle. Life is but a path to death, but not today. How insightful. Yes, of course. The closer you approach death, the more you appreciate life. I will pull myself together. Thank you. That was kind of you. No problem. No hay problema. Travel log. Team cor corresponding rewards. Complete objectives in the travel log. Ah, okay, so this is like my time crunch. Oh, this is my log on thing. I'll have to grab all these. Those look like star passes. Permanent, permanent, okay. Well, let's do these. These are time limit. Before we forget. We want you to spend your... Trying to get this guy. Shot. Might be trickier to crack. Consecutive normal punches. Either one of these is a. Uh, let's do it in there. Time for a buzz. <laughs> let's go. He doesn't have either one as his bones, but let's just do it. What about this? Ah, it's a healer, whoever this is. Doesn't say her in the What's her little design? Something. <laughs> Think nothing of it. 
Naughty children, don't listen. Savor the vigor of life. Yeah, we got him. Time for a buzz. <laughs> I told you I could fight. With me out here, how can we lose? The truth of life and death, revealed in an instant. This sanctuary is but a vision. Oh my god, let's go. One hit point left. Step aside. I have no interest in stoking conflict. Told you I could fight. Let's make it quick. You can't run. What if you can upgrade the weapon? Like, am I gonna get a different kind of baseball bat, or do I always have the exact same kind of baseball? Fight. Let's go. Clemency? Never heard of it. Uh, rules are made to be broken! Step aside. I have no time. Never heard of it. Everything is ordained by the stars. Speed boost, fire damage boost. Oh. Who's the lucky one How much today? of a boost is it? Come <laughs> on. 
A guest with no manners, huh? <laughs> A gift from the stars. This is our chance. Lisa. Her hair is like weird glowing kind of. Can't stop the run. Can't stop the run. Can't stop the run. So you take damage both times? Or you hit multiple times first. Time for the main event. on a frozen thing looks like it's very powerful. <clears throat> Alright, she joined your team. The departure warp is a discount. I wonder how long that discount is. Oh, I don't have any. I thought I did. So that's what this little... There's a special pass, that's not, not where I thought it was. Are you thinking of going back? Well, let me remind you. That's the Doomsday Beast. The Legion's planet destroyer. The space station is Herta's creation. As long as the Lord Ravager doesn't intervene, there should be no problems. But we can't just run away like this, right? The Doomsday Beast can rip off the defense shield like tearing paper. And who 
Joker does not hear. The station's defenses are too weak to stand against the Antimatter Legion. Either way, the Legion has the blessing of the Eon Nanook. They came prepared, and everyone is here. That's why we have to leave and take him with us. Hmm? He's that important? He's the one who can help us turn the tides. Of course I may be wrong. <clears throat> As you say so. Alright. What should we do next? This is the supply zone where the maintenance crew works. There's a path here that leads to the railway platform. Let's head over there and meet up with Welt. Mr. Yang? Mr. Yang's here too? Didn't he stay on the express? The Astral Express tracks our coordinates in real time. And with such a huge change in the space station's movements, there's no way Mr. Yang wouldn't have noticed. Mm hmm I can almost guarantee that your Mr. Yang is already on his way. Right now, we might be able to handle things if it's just the Doomsday Beast, but if the Destruction's Emanator were to appear... I can't handle the Destruction's Emanator. still feel things won't be going as my house anymore. Let's hurry up and get out of here. I'll explain later. Alright, we gotta fight that thing and then we can. Interest in stoking conflict. Launch follow-up attack during battle. Weakness break, she gets a charge. Oh. The truth of life and death revealed in an instant. This There's a weakness break. It's but a right. vision. Yep. You won't get away. It's too late to repent. for you. Home run. You couldn't have done it without me. Your obstacles can be my Level five. Ooh. Much higher level than us. Clemency? Never heard of it. I told you I could fight. With me out here, how can we lose? Let's make it quick. You won't get away. I have something for you. You're annoying. It's more like Dilu. 
try hard sometimes. Check out this awesome move! Fight this one. Let's see a chest in there. You won't get away. Uh, rules are made to be broken. Perhaps you still don't understand. Humanity never conceals its desire mm. to control the heavens. Drink coffee. And I'm no exception. Got a big chest behind him. Let's go fight him. I'll oh, shoot that. That's all I do. Hmm. Eleven uh, red. Now or crush later. Let's uh, check on everybody's health. Anybody about to level up? Stuck at level one. Did I never use switch you in? It's like twenty is the max. Level him up to seven. We'll try fighting this thing. It's a little above us, but I want to see what happens. We'll use her to freeze him. Freeze! Freeze! Move carefully. He looks awfully frozen. The truth of life and death, revealed in an instant, this sanctuary is but a vision! Super strong. Hey, there we go. My turn. Knock him down quick. Who's the ice person, this person? Let's go. Alright, he doesn't like baseball. Afraid of fire. Guess we'll get him. He's probably there. So I guess we're gonna die now because we don't to do this. Ooh, back kick. Oh, he's almost. 
So close. Get free to know. Yeah, we broke him. Heal himself. My turn. The truth of life and death, revealed in an instant to this sanctuary, is but a vision. Not bad, not bad. Put the shield on you. With me out here, how can we lose? Let's make it quick. I'll try hard sometimes. Check out this awesome move. <laughs> Hey, frozen. Uh, let's blast him. About this. Time for a detailed overhaul. Fatal blow. Try that again. He's still alive. Shield didn't work. Or the shield did work. Humanity never conceals its desire to control the heavens. And I am no exception. I am so close to die. Let's go. Last you into another. You won't get away. This is it. Wipe them out. It's too late to repent. Revenge. Not too much. Combat is a series of precise match. One at a time. Aww. I forgot to do the ultimate. This would have been a much easier if I had not used this before I pulled to be broken. Still can get him. He's got a hair left. And then he killed two of them. Not over yet. We got him. We beat the guy 15 levels above us. Formidable foe defeated. There's the big chest. That's all we got. Avoid. Nihility. Nihility. Alright. Let's go heal. Back to work. Oh, shiny! Ooh, sparkly! The truth of life and death revealed in an instant. This See how much easier this guy is. But a vision. So much easier. Just do it. Right you have the worst luck running into me. Watch this. 
Let's make it quick. What about this? You won't get away. I have something for you. Clemency? Never heard of it. The time is now. My turn. <laughs> I have something for you. Got him. You couldn't have done it without me. More, more guys to fight. You won't get away. Perhaps you still don't understand. Humanity never conceals its desire to control the heavens, and I'm no exception. Revealed in an end, this sanctuary is but a vision. My turn. <sighs> Let's go. Time for a detailed overhaul. Clemency? Never heard of it. You have the worst luck running into me! This is our chance. Level 6, alright, we gotta level up. Bumped into a dragon. It's really here. Get down here. Early dragon boss time. Uh, careful, everyone. Gotta try hard sometimes. Check out this awesome move! Huh. Uh. 
can't fire. Move carefully. Alright, we got wind. Wind's gotta go this way. You won't get away. My turn. Ice has gotta go this way. Let's do four first. Perhaps you still don't understand. Humanity never conceals its desire to control the heavens. And I'm no exception. You have the worst luck running into me. <sighs> That is a series of precise machinations. Someone, hold on. We have three. Follow up. You won't get away. Left hand is broken. And they restore it. Percy. Wind was against the right hand, so I'll just gonna... My turn. Let's make it quick. Right hand's broken. The truth of life and death, revealed in an instant. This sanctuary is but a vision! Total annihilation. Uh oh. Not quite total. Yeah, the engine's been broken. Now he's at 100%. What? You have the worst luck running into me. Oh, uh, weakness is exposed. Watch this. You won't get away. What this? Home run. I think we regenerated for putting the target in. Oh my gosh, this battle's gonna take more than five seconds. Perhaps you still don't understand. Humanity never conceals its desire to control the heavens. Here comes two attacks. And I'm no exception. Never heard of it. The time is now. Engine game struggle. Recovered from break. And the dawn is now. My turn. Not your turn. Rules are made to be broken. Right, home run coming. You won't get away. Move. 
right hand's been broken. Left hand's been broken. <clears throat> Catacombs and creepers here. Perhaps you still don't understand. You're not gonna make it. You're gonna be gone after control the heavens. And you have no shield. The truth of life and death revealed in an instant. This Finish him off. It's but a vision. Engine's been broken. They're not repaired. Oh, we have to finish him off again. Weakness exposed. Let's go. What about this? Combat is a series of precise. <laughs> Battle over. All right. Only had to do three times. That was close. We almost lost Don Hang. We lost somebody. That's me. It was me. What happened? Yes. Who is Is this the space station? Hello there. Not bad. It would have been even better if you didn't faint. But thanks to you, the Doomsday Beast was as tame as a kitten. It had no temper at all. Who am I? Where am I? You are kidding, right? Get up when you feel better. Himeko wants you to go find her. I have something to do, so I won't go with you, alright? By the way, we should exchange beacons. If you get lost or something, feel free to text me. You exchange your cell phone number okay. with her. Off I go. Bye. New message. Hey there, this is March. Imeko wants to t talk to you about something, don't forget. For raising the destruction Eidolon's love. Open the character to activate him. Ten extra energy. Ten energy. Wow. It's a reward for using my ultimate. much here. You're awake. 
had March and Dan Hung stay by the express to keep an eye on things. It's almost time. She should be arriving any moment now. I've only been gone, what, a few months? And the space station is already in this state? Welcome back, Herda. This is the true master of the space station. Genius Society number 83, Herda. At least give me a proper introduction. Genius Society number 83? Of all my outstanding achievements, that's what you want to mention? You're a robot? What you're seeing here is one of my puppets. I'm using her to talk to you. So, this little twerp has the Stellaron now? Huh. Hmm. I'll have to take a good look. Hmm. Truly amazing! I built a whole space station just to contain this unactivated Stellaron and keep the blue from disaster. Yet someone was able to achieve that with this little twerp's body? How'd they do it? Moreover, the Stellaron is still very stable in his body. You're right! This little one's body truly is strange. Don't call me little one. My name is Mangler3M. Must you two discuss this right in front of me? My name is All right! I got it. But I'm still gonna call you Little Twerp. The space in my brain is too valuable to store people's names. Oh! Well, thanks for remembering my name then. That's different. We have business with each other. Um, what was your name again? Uh, uh, forget it. Uh, let's focus on the one who can store a Stellaron in their body. Can I bring him in for some research? That's not up to me to decide. You can ask him yourself. No way. Study what? What's your price? Study what? Study you, of course. Your body contains a Stellaron, which in some sense is no different than storing a bomb. Who knows what might happen? Maybe it'll blow you to bits someday. Yikes. You should be grateful that this genius is willing to help you out. I still have some interest now, but once that's gone, I'm not studying you even if you beg me. I'm very interested now. So there's almost nothing I won't accommodate. A Stellaron in your body? How interesting is that? Be grateful that I'm offering to help you out. This is a service even the IPC can't buy. You understand now? Herda wants you to stay in her space station. Well, I'm going to have to modify your wording here. This little twerp can only stay temporarily until the research is done. Or maybe I'll lose half just halfway through and they can just beat it. And after that? Not my problem. You also have another option. The Astral Express. If you want, you can leave with us. The Express has its fair share of experiences with Celeron. The thing you're worried about and the answers we're looking for are one and the same. Besides, we can come back any time to let her to conduct your research. She's absolutely fascinated now. Hmm. Well, works for me. Keep the subject fresh, too. And that way, I won't need to keep worrying about this little twerp all the time. Get on the Express or stay behind. You really are the most self-centered person I've ever met. I'll think about who Nick was offer. Yes, give it some good thought. Just remember to come back often. Make an appointment in advance with Asta or Arlen so I can make time to study you. There's no need to rush into this, Herda. Asta's in the master control zone. Let's let him have a talk with Asta first and decide for himself. I'll be waiting for you on the platform. It's no hurry if you still have things to do or someone to see. Come find me when you've made a decision. New message. Herda says, come to my office quickly, I'm waiting. But you're right next to me, can't you just tell me? Automatic reply. Hi, I'm currently unavailable. I'll be, I won't be contacting you later. We lost Himeko. Team, 
team setup. Add a character to your team. You guys again. Zendar One Kubara, Genius Society member one. I hung up his portrait purely out of respect. Without him, there would be no Genius Society today. Frankly, I don't know what he has achieved. None of his books and inventions have survived. Uh, but there's got to be a place for the founder of the society, right? From her perspective. Olga Kakamund, member four of the Genius Society, a woman full of mystery. Many people in the society died by her hand. I haven't heard anything about her for many years, but I firmly believe she is still alive. Yeah, she hey, was in the beginning. Lord of Silence, if you're here, if you're listening, I'm member 83, Herda, and I want to meet you. I believe you and I will have a lot to talk about. This is Aiden, member 22 of the Genius Society. The most selfless and the strangest one. He spent his whole life helping others. Personally, I don't see the point. But the society is famous thanks to him. The Inter-Astral Peace Corporation has been trying to find a replacement ever since his death. They searched for many Amber Eras, but no genius was willing to lower their head to the IPC. Until they found me. Oh, Elias Salas, such a lovely old fellow. He is member 56 of the Genius Society, one of the only two publicly elected ministers in the society's history. Be grateful to him. He created the Synthesia Beacons and Overrange Remote Sensing, the cornerstones of modern cosmic communication. However, he did not disclose his inventions to the public. So I hereby certify that the rights of these two technologies belong to the Intelligentsia Guild. To be honest, I'm not a big fan of the guild, but it is impressive that they managed to reproduce Elias Salas' inventions. Member 76 of the Genius Society, Skrulum. I've known him for a long time. He's a really good man, a gentleman with an exceptional mechanical mind. I've learned a lot from him. Recently, I have been working with him and Ron May on a project. I hope this project can help us get closer to the greatest mystery of the universe. How'd you get here so soon? I haven't moved. What you're seeing is one of my remote control puppets. They're all over the station. I just connect to one wherever I am needed. Enough chit chat. I am working on a big project with a few colleagues. If we succeed, it will answer the ultimate question that's been puzzling us for thousands of amber eras. The truth about eons. Eons. Think about it. What mystical existences. Some eons used to be ordinary humans like you and me, but somehow they managed to obtain power beyond our imagination. They are mysterious, powerful, silent, and terrifying. It's hard to explain all the mysteries surrounding them. How were they created? Why were they created? What were they created for? Have you ever thought about these questions? 
all the time. Great! Curiosity is the foundation of science. Now we can't just think about it, we should also act. I want to give you the chance to participate in this project. Let's work together. The four geniuses of the society wrote a program together. You see the big machine in the office? That machine contains a universe. Just like the universe we live in, but it's more streamlined and customized. I call it the metaverse. Seriously, don't ride that hype train. Oh, really? That's what my partner said as well. Fine. I am a team player. Then let's call it the simulated universe. Now go and experience it for yourself. I will guide you in the simulated universe to make sure nothing happens to you. I'll even give you a substantial reward. First closed beta start. Plane. 10 star rail passes. That's for travel, I assume. Yeah, these are warps. Oh, they are warps. Okay, so it says starter warp, departure warp, remaining 50 out of 50 for these in their discount. Or you can try for Silver Wolf or Incessant Rain. Or every 10 gives you a guaranteed 4 or above. So we could go to Jeopard. Bronia. This is permanent. Let's try let's try this one, incessant rain. Oh, we only have one? I keep thinking we have multiple. Oh these go to here. These go to here. Oh, okay. Fine, we'll try one right here. Our first port. Okay, so we just got a light cone, cone light thing. Multiplication. Does it keep track of how many I've done so far? No. Anyway, alright, let's use these ones. What are we gonna get? Wait again, we just have we already have one of those voids. Multiplication, we already have one of those multiplications. Data bank, that's new. Adversarial, that's new. Multiplication again. Amber. Adversarial again. Loop. <clears throat> hey, Sampo! There one, nihility, whatever. Okay, so we got a new character. Let's get him... Can't use the traces like the other people. Okay, so we get a choice. We can use this one. Damage from to where to slow. Increase against slow units. I don't have anything that does slow unless that's a magic thing for him. Start of battle, hit rate goes up 20%. Um, lame. Okay, I'm gonna see if his spell does. What's his abilities? Talents. 65% inflict wind shear. 50% wind increased DOT skill technique. It doesn't say slow on any of these. <sighs> That means 
these are all kind of like... We'll do effective effect here. And we can now look and see if there's anything better on this. Goes up, speed goes up. We need to feed an enemy. Oh, everything up twenty percent. That's all you got. Going to the simulated universe. Entering Facebook. You see this message? If you do, just tap anywhere on the screen. Your body is still sitting in the office. This is a simulated universe generated from your memories. This is only the alpha test server where the features are not fully available. I try to walk around. I'm trying. Oh, so it's a bug. Oh, I can walk. You can move around. Play some monsters to fight. See who you notice first. Keep at it. Two kids. Not to fight alone. Too late to repent. Auto battle. Automatically use these abilities in combat. Sky. It's dusk. You look up and find countless copper ore, amber, and opal falling from the sky. Wondrous mineral rain. In this team, the colossal things stretch their spine from the mantle with a sledgehammer gripped in their broad palm. You open your eyes and realize that this is actually Clypoth, the eon of preservation. This is this a new trick by Herda? There is a huge roar around them. There, this is a warning for you. Then they disappear before your eyes. Our calculations are correct. Clypoth, the Eon of Preservation, has really appeared. Berta's voice suddenly sounded, and she let on the biggest giggle. The Eon of Trailblaze. Akavili's revival has attracted an old friend. Tell me more stories about the relations with Eons. What you saw is a simulated eon carefully cultivated by Ryan, May, and Shrulam. The simulated eons will ignore us just like the real ones. So I set your simulated identity as Akavili Eon of Trailblaze to attract them. With a click of her tongue, Erda says, Now it seems that my judgment is correct. Next time you run into the eon, try to get something out of it. You must know more about gossip than I do. <coughs> Myths of the eons, anecdotes, love stories, the origin of the universe, anything will do. Berta was annoyed. Just think of something. I'll cover you for this test. See, I use my clearance to enhance your blessings. Now you can go have some fun. Don't ask why, just think. Go pick one. Alright, we can either do characters, receive a shield at the end of the turn, Upon entering battle, you gain a shield. Inflict weakness on a target. Character gains a shield. This one's too sharp, so. For opportunities, combat strike. Alright, so. 
He's got restore on his main one. I don't. I don't use this one. Why well, only have three people? It shouldn't have four. This will strengthen our position. Stack in the back. Clemency? Never heard of it. My turn. Gotta try hard sometimes. Check out this awesome move. Let's go. Last, Clypoth didn't come. I guessed as much. Pick the blessing that turns shields into damage and hurry onward. Save it in case it can be reused for the next person. You have the worst luck running it. Yes, you can. The truth of life and death revealed in an instant. This sanctuary is but a vision. Never heard of it. Uh, rules are made to be broken. You got danger, welcome. 
It's too late to repent. The truth of life and death revealed in an instant. This sanctuary is but a vision. Let's go. Yeah. Come on. Chose the wrong one. Well, they probably won't come. Sorry, I simply revoked your activity permissions. Uh, I need to apologize to you about something. I confess I'm a little eager for success. I won't interfere with the system again. Just play as you like. Well, Fleet Boss appearance was probably just a coincidence. That's it. Anyway, I'm sorry. Target on her head. With me out here, how can we lose? Let's make it quick. Life and death revealed in an instant. This sanctuary is but a vision. Let's go. My turn. Gotta try hard sometimes. Check out this awesome move. Fight is over, you wait in place, nothing happens. Berta? What should I do? There's a long silence followed by deep sigh by Herda. I was expecting them to appear. Never mind, I'll switch off the simulated universe then. It'll only take a second and you won't feel a thing. Let's chat back in reality. Berta? Did you say it'll only take a second? They came. You hear Herda's stunned words. No, not them. It's another eon. It's her. Voice suddenly drifts off. 
you have a strange feeling about this, as if Herta's words solidified in the whole so simulated universe itself. Became somehow unreal. You see a blurry figure made of mirror fragments, and their facial features are repeated, repeatedly refracted by the prism to form a mystery. Countless memories spring up before your eyes. You see Kafka. Her body is stretched, deformed, and rubbed together with an umbrella in her hand, turning into water droplets and falling at your feet. You find yourself become a weeping. Ad livum baby with an uncut umbilical cord. You remember that there is a golden scar on your body and golden blood flowing on the dying planet. You find yourself dark skinned and wearing a robe of, on the wasteland. You find that you are a swift shadow across the abyss, reaching out to catch the shooting star. Oh my god. Then their voice suddenly came. The robe flutters and wraps around your dark skin. You laugh at exploration. The silk threads spin, overlap, and weave into oceanic birds. Every word they say is connected to each other like a whisper. Before you could say anything, they suddenly disappear. Wait, let's talk about Kafka. We did it! Hardy yells with excitement. That was fury, fully. They thought that you were the fallen Akavili, so they actively started a conversation with you. Fuli is valuable for our research because they have the memories of all beings and know almost as much about everything as newest does. Come on out, Mangler. I want to upgrade the simulated universe. You need to stay in there even longer in the future. You said you wouldn't interfere anymore. It feels like a hook pulled on your belly button your entire body tumbled in a circle. When you open your eyes, you're suddenly back in Herta's office. Your first experience of the simulated universe has ended. Success. I have to tell the news to Steven right away. Mangler, don't just stand there. Go in again for a walk and see if you can get a few more words out of them or something. Alright, I'll go now. I've upgraded the simulated universe. Now it has even more RAM and can support longer sessions. I guess the last round was pretty boring. I'll let Steven to add some more fun stuff. This part is especially new for you. I hope you have lots of fun. Not as good as getting the work in real life. That's for sure. After all, you're gonna be spending more time on this platform. Overall, it's a long scheduled version update with longer gameplay, more content, better rewards, and a more bizarre difficulty of her. So get ready, prepare to get back into the simulated universe beta test. I will help you out more. Herta! New character. Same one I already had. It increases the ultimate. Teleport function, fast travel.
Cheese. <laughs> oh, they want me to go there. But that meant there. <laughs> where it was. Hey, um. It's Pete. I got your number without asking. Are you still at the space station? Of course, I haven't said for a while yet. The station is launching a program called Project Revival. If you have some time, I'd like to ask for help. Uh-oh, my phone credits for the month are running out. This could be my last message. Tell him I'll be waiting. Accept admission. Road to Revival. Okay, so this one rewards is some money and some experience. This one is rewards is experience, money, I guess. Lots of experience. Well, let's navigate there and see. Wanna go take some pictures? Harlan, head of security, reporting to. Oh, it's you, Wrangler. Sorry, I didn't recognize you at first. I was just thinking about ways to improve the security department's emergency response screen. After all, this is also an important part of Project Revival. If the Legion dares to attack us again, I don't want to make things easier for them. Project Revival? Well, Project Revival is a set of post-disaster disaster operational protocols that Lady Asta and the heads of the five departments collaboratively developed using data gathered about the damage sustained by the space station. It also involves many other confidential initiatives such as Curio Collection Squad, Security Zoning, and the Interastral Peace Corporation's Damage Assessment. Curio Collection what? Curio Collection Squad, Security Zoning, and the Damage Assessment of Interastral Peace Corporation are all part of Project Revival. But the implementation of Project Revival is not easy, and Lady Asta believes that the number of personnel needs to needed exceeds our previous estimates. Sorry if it seems to come out of nowhere, but Mangler, would you like to help? You protected me in the past when we battled those Legion monsters. Mangler, you are truly a trustworthy comrade. That's why I immediately thought of seeking your help. How can we hear without any good for me? Please just order me around as you can. Not an order at all. If you are willing to help, we'd really appreciate it. It's nothing too difficult, really. The department staff are busy with project revival. Can you please go to every zone in the space station to see if they need assistance? By the way, here's the commission fee, a total of 648. I I'm not sure how much I should offer you since my living expenses are already covered by the space station. I have no idea how much money is worth. I won't charge you any. Hopefully with your help in project revival, Lady Asta will finally be the next. All right. In the reception hall where I was working on Project Revival, oh, this is this is a really sudden. I don't know how this popped up. I was trying to do something else, and this message popped up. Hit the send all button. Oh. I get so many friends. Uh, technically, this is your friends list. is no problem, my researchers. So sorry if my travel is inconvenienced to you in any way. I've already taken it to my on myself to block the rest of your admirers who are still queuing to add you to the friends list. As for all those requests already received, it's up to you to decide what to do with them. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and 
put a cut in the video for now. Um, I'm gonna double check see if anyone else is on. Looks like Lady Con's on, so I'll go ahead and read them. Alright. It worked. Okay. Cheese. Have a good one. Ah, there's the exit. 